Good morning. I'm going to do a math project today. Uh, topic is sum of three angles of a triangle equal to 180 degree. I have a triangle over here and you can see that I have three angles A, B and C. I'll just show you uh, that sum of these three angles equal to 180 degree. But I have two congruent triangles, same shape, same size. Uh, the triangle I have underneath, it has the measurement of the angles. So I'm not going to show it to you right now. I'll show it later on. I'll just put it aside. Before I start, you have to uh, agree with one thing that if I have a line segment AB, straight line segment AB, and if I have a point over here, then uh, point O in between, then AOB equal to 180 degree. Some of you already know this is a straight angle. Uh, the way it goes that if I if I if I just rotate that like this O A O, o B line segment and it comes to O A new position of B is A then the angle it makes is 180 degree. You have to uh, understand this concept to understand that one. Uh, let me show you a proof of this one. A neat proof. If if I have over here this triangle in tri this triangle a b c angles let it be a b and c if you draw a parallel line which is parallel to this line okay if you just do that then you know this is these two lines are parallel these two lines are parallel then this angle equal to this angle this angle equal to this angle we call that alternate angles, alternate exterior angles. And this angle and this angle equal, this angle and this angle equal, we call that corresponding angles because if, if you see that similarly placed, this B, if you slide it over here, it's B, same. So we call that corresponding angles and these are alternate interior angles. Now, all these three triangles, uh, three angles of this triangle, Let's name that uh, A, B, C. Now, A, B, C, in this triangle, I have three angles A, B, C. But over here, remember, this, this makes 180 degree. Now, look at the sum of this three angles equal to A, B, C, which are the angles of this triangle. So, this is 180 degree over here, according to this. Since this is 180 degree, sum of these three angles of this triangle A, B, C equal to 180 degree as well this is one of the proof i'll show you another neat proof okay uh, i'm going to take this triangle here and what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna cut into pieces from this i want to i don't want to use the pair of scissors i'll just use my hand to do that so it's gonna be uneven okay I hope it, it will look nice. I'll just rip it off. Okay, remember it was like this. Okay. Uh, where was it? Okay, it was like this. Okay, ABC. And let me find my scale. If I draw a straight line, okay, I draw this a straight line and let's put this point O over here. So, AB. A, B and this O. This is 180 degree. Okay, this is 180 degree. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to put A over here. See that A right over here. And then C, I'll put that straight sides are here. So it's like this. And then this B over here. See that? Sum of these three angles becomes 180 degree so by showing you this i can prove that sum of three angles of a triangle equal to 180 degree now since this is done let, let me just glue this together so it's going to be nice and it will stay together okay it has a st strong smell so if you are using this kind of glue make sure if you if you cannot stand that move your head away otherwise it can make you sick all right i hope it will stay here okay so a b and c c is upside down but it's all right okay you can see that the sum of these three angles 
equal to 180 degree. Now, based on this theory, okay, we always can find out some of other polygons interior angles, okay. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is a pentagon. What would be the sum pentagon? What would be the sum of all interior angles of a pentagon? Now, based on this one, if I just join few lines and make different triangles, this is one triangle, this is second triangle, this is third triangle. So I have three triangles. Now, sum, sum of all three angles of a triangle is 180 degree. Now I have 180 over here, one, two, three. Let's, let's use different pen, different color. One, two, three. So sum of this three is 180 degree. Sum of this three is 180 degree. And then I have this sum of this three equal to 180 degree. So actually I have 180 times three, 500. 40 degree. So sum of interior angles, all the interior angles of a pentagon equal to 540 degree. Now, can we do this? So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 sides. Now, 1, 2, I'm making triangles. 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, so there are 5 triangles. So sum of all these angles would be 5 times 180 degree. Whatever that comes, that's the summation of all angles of this. Uh, I believe it's uh, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This is a heptagon. Heptagon, okay. This polygon's sum of interior angles equal to whatever that comes. Okay, I'll let you do that. Now there is a formula. You can use it. Sum of interior angles of a polygon polygon okay the formula goes like that 2n minus 4 times 90 or sometimes uh, some people they just bring this take this 2 common and make this one n minus 2 and this 2 multiply by that 180 okay so there was three three sides of this triangle so if you put 3 over here, 3 minus 2 is 1, 1 times 180 is 180, sum of 3 angles of a triangle. Now there was 5 sides, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So if you put 5, 5 minus 2 is 3, 3 times 180 is 570. Okay, and over here uh, you have 7, 7 minus 2 is 5, 5 times 180 is whatever that comes. Okay, uh, this is what happens. I'll just bring this one when I measured that the angle B angle A was 54 50 of oh, this is a sorry 54 degree B was 32 degree and C I measure with the protector it was 94 degree so if we add that 54 plus 94 plus 32 you're gonna get 2 plus 46 6 plus 4 is 10 carrying one so four and nine thirteen and five one hundred eighty so that's what it is by measuring or by calculating or like that you can see that sum of three angles of a triangle equal to 180 degree i hope you like it thank you very much have a good day